I found a Reddit for like uh, like video game collection. <clears throat> oh fuck! Yeah, to oh, show yeah. how many video games you have. And there's people that like just have rooms. They're like my my collection room. <laughs> Hey, it's so fucking gay, dude. <laughs> it's really all. It's really sad, dude. Yeah, <laughs> it's like that's that's what they aspired to. They were in like 1993. No, you know what? It's not even. Yeah, that's sad. What's even sadder is there's a guy being like, "Damn, yeah." And he has like half of that many games. <laughs> you yeah. know what I mean? Like, there's a guy who's not even that guy who wishes he was. Yeah. No, because I was like, I was looking at old. Uh, I don't know. Sometimes I just I read about connectors and video signals or whatever i forget where it started i think i started like reading about like console televisions mm-hmm. do you remember those like the big tube ass motherfuckers well yes. the ones with a vcr in them no the ones that like look like a fucking like a yeah like a credenza oh yes. like a piece of yes. furniture yeah, yeah. yeah. they like got their wood box yeah, yeah. Fake from like the 60s it. yes yeah. i fucked with those yeah my grandpa had one and uh it's like we you know you just accept things but then you get older and you're like what the fuck was that shit i know it's like well yeah it's it's also a table or something yeah yeah it was just furniture dude yeah uh you know those and then i started looking at uh like sony crt reference monitors Apparently, the video game community, the retro gaming collection community, they buy these like Sony uh, like reference monitors that accept like an RGB signal because mm-hmm. it makes. I mean, you, there's no the way quality it makes, is better. The zero chance it makes it better. Yeah, there's fucking no chance in the world. <laughs> yes, it look better than just using whatever cable. Hundred percent. Super Nintendo. I agree with that. And then there's these guys that spend like twelve hundred dollars. On shitty, outdated technology that like doesn't make sense to use at all, and then the monitors themselves are like fucking fourteen to twenty inches. Yeah, oh, tiny. What? Yeah, it looks awful. Like a kitchen TV. Yeah, but then you know the boxes are huge because they're made for like, like, uh, like network news rooms and shit. Oh so shit! You yeah, can like yeah. monitor recordings and make sure that they're like color accurate. What? Yeah. Damn, and, uh, that sucks. I saw a thread on Reddit where somebody's like, I just picked this up for $900. <laughs> and then one guy's like, yeah, that's really stupid. This is all just junk. You're just collecting garbage and selling garbage to each other. And all these like these replies are like, you're in the wrong subreddit. <laughs> <laughs> He's getting all defensive about it. just blowing their parents' money on news TVs. I cannot believe there's a market. For, like, wouldn't they be able to just find that in the trash? Um, I <clears> guess <throat> there's probably an application for like smaller. Like, you do probably do need color accurate monitors for video applications if you're doing something with that. But no, it's probably entirely propped up by one retard on like these v- retro gaming forums. Like ten years ago, is probably like, well, look what I did. And then the rest of them are like, yep, that'll legitimize my gay-ass hobby. <laughs> <laughs> what are they even playing? Like fucking Atari? Yeah, they're playing like fucking Super Mario World. That sucks, dude. <laughs> yeah, like regular that Nintendo. sucks. It's really stupid. Oh, my God. Especially because I just played... I they, they put like all a bunch of Super Nintendo games on Switch. I just replayed Super Metroid. And I guarantee you, you're not having a better experience. Not even close. Not, yeah. It's so easy. You do it at a, on a whim. You just download the shit. You yeah. play it for like eight hours. You're yeah. done with it. It's great. I love it. It's yeah. a great game. I don't need a fucking network news television from 1997. Oh, my God. That's imagine, really sad, man. Imagine how little pussy those guys get. Yeah. <laughs> just negative <laughs> amounts of pussy. Yeah. That oh, sucks. yeah. Probably never. Yeah. Yeah. They don't have sex. They've never <laughs> even honked a tit. <laughs> oh my god, that fucking sucks, dude. <laughs> like being ner- being a thirty eight year old man who's nervous to talk to a woman. Yeah, <laughs> there was a guy like that who would do open mics in D.C. This guy that was like fat and bald and ugly. It was like it wasn't even like if he lost the weight, he would still be like a, yeah. z- a zero. <laughs> right, <laughs> right, right. Like an absolute. There's no path. There's not, there's not, no path to pussy. There's no way. Yeah, 
And uh, he would just constantly get fired from jobs for sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> and he lived with his parents, and he just he was like forty two, and just like never even got a taste. Oh, ne- never once. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> yeah. Oh fuck. Yeah, they were like, people were like, why? Like, why? I remember asking, like, why doesn't he just buy a prostitute? And they were like, I don't know. Like, you get to that point, and it's like you just give up on it. And it's like, fuck. That's brutal. damn. Oh, he, he just like doesn't even get horny. At yeah, that he had point. a he had a stroke, I think, and uh, then it got even worse. Damn, his dick got even softer. Yeah, his life got worse. He, like lost function, and so he never had sex. Never. Oh fuck, dude. Damn, I I gotta say it is cool to have sex. Yeah, I wish I never had sex. You can stop. I'm never going to stop, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I love this shit. Dude, I'm literally obsessed with pussy, and it's exhausting. Nice, man. Are what you? do people... People say that online. They're like, I'm so exhausted. Yeah, I'm exhausted. I'm, I'm exhausted. exhausted. I'm exhausted.